Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to make a, let's say, long time review wire strippers uh, from Powerfix, available at Lille. Let's say combine together with uh, showing you the quality, general quality of the, of the tools, how they are behaving after a few years. Uh, you need to know that uh, those clippers are not so not, not the same as you can see the design have been have changed over the years those clippers are from 2014 but it has been those has been storage uh, uh, indoor if you don't believe me this is a production date 2014 it's a de December of uh, 2014 the production date so I have most likely bought it them few months later maybe it was it was a February March something like that and those clippers have been produced and actually there is no production date and to be honest I cannot remember where it was but it was after uh, uh, botting them those those first one and uh, you need to know that those has been stored uh, in outdoor conditions I mean in not heated garage and as you can see the rust is literally everywhere in such places that in my opinion it's uh, in some way I will use them but are for sure not for small wires so this is the let's say quality of the tools if you keeping them and storage them in the Let's, let, let's say moisture free conditions it's fine if not you will get into such situation second thing it's a general quality as you can see it should not move an inch this it's not moving so actually it's this is better one but I have a concern is it the question of the rust that is uh, underneath so might be the rust that has attacked here so actually it's 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 sealing by the rusting what else in general the plastic survived rubber as well no problem at all in terms of a uh, quality consistency uh, I would highlight it's uh, it's offset a little bit here is in the middle and that's and this uh, is offset it's not let's say even in the middle small let's say nothing nothing special but uh, yeah so uh, let's give it a try one remark because I cannot turn it so it will be let's say I will I will do my best to to take over Okay, surprisingly good. Actually, why while using it, it will clean it up because I will remove as well the the rust and small wire. Because I cannot adjust it, I'm doing the best I can to keep it. So actually still even if it's it has a plenty of rust on it it can take insulation out of such small cables and as well here without any damage and for those of you who are curious about the dimension I will show the dimension it should be here yes it is so it's a half millimeter up to 300 volts produced also a while ago in 2014 but it is what it is I have bought it some years ago you need, you need some wires in your garage for some small repairs so uh, this I will okay I will try give it a try as well maybe from the other hand other side 
Uh, okay. Let me adjust. Too much. Okay, should be okay. Should be okay. And now, slightly slower, not slower, smaller. And again, the, I will take a bluish cable. For those of you who are not familiar how the, those uh, wire strippers work, it's actually, as you can see, okay, I need to make it a little, little bit smaller. But I think it will be too small. Okay, again. In my opinion, the hole is tiny, so I'm 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 wor worrying to not damage it. But okay, okay. Actually, it, it's something odd, but I would say that those. Uh, strippers are behaving better, I mean the old ones, uh, and maybe the rust provide additional roughness, who knows, but uh, for sure I don't like when my tools are rusting, so one hint for you, if you buy a power fix tools, uh, please keep them uh, indoors, out of moisture, and if you uh, wet them in some in this or another way just uh, clean them afterwards so just just to just to keep them in shape so I hope you enjoy I hope you was able to, uh, to compare side by side and uh, as always thank you for watching stay tuned and see you next time bye